Hey, gals and guys, this is Chris Mojo from MyMediaHelper.com, and I was going through some um, older older video clips from a long time ago that I've never posted uh, before, so I wanted to get some of those out there because some of them are kind of interesting. This particular one is called Remote Rochester uh, in Rochester, New York, coincidentally. Um, so this was at um, the Fringe Festival, and the Fringe Festival in Rochester, New York is just, um, it's kind of a unique acts that come around from around the country and around the world. Um, and this is just a kind of, it's not exactly an act, it's more of a, a tour and a, I don't know if you can call it a show. So basically what it is in a nutshell, real quick, and then I'll play the video, is you get a group of people together, uh, they all have headphones on, like I do, and they are listening um, to different types of commands, um, different instructions um, as they go on this tour. And then eventually, not to give too much away, um, I'm not sure if you could tell in this video anyways, um, eventually these groups will split up and given different commands and it's um, it's just an interesting way to do a, a tour and uh, there's an article right here about it that I'll post um, uh, in the in the comments section if you, you want to learn more about it but it's pretty cool so uh, it's about 15 16 minutes uh, so check it out so I'm going to narrate some of this or all you're going to see is a bunch of people walking around with headsets with no context and I'll do my best to recall things as this was about seven years ago when uh, I filmed it and I pull the following from an article I'm going to post in the description for proper credit and it just reads that the tour starts at Spiegel Garden and that's at the corner of Main and Gibbs Street. That's at the heart of Fringe, and from there you and other fellow journeyers get your headphones and then hop a school bus to Mount Hope Cemetery, where the tour embarks. When everyone's made their way to the meeting point, you get instructions, don your headset, and the tour begins. And your guide is a synthetic voice that leads you on a journey through the city, encouraging you to see nature, consider the technology, and ponder these humans you're traveling with. I ponder humans all day long mostly myself. Mount Hope Cemetery in Rochester, Monroe County, New York was founded in 1838. It is the first municipal cemetery in the United States. It is the burial site of Susan B. Anthony and Frederick Douglass, situated in a, on 196 acres of land adjacent to the University of Rochester on Mount Hope Avenue. This cemetery is the permanent resting place of over 350,000 people the annual growth rate of the cemetery is about 500 to 600 burials per year. The cemetery hosts sculpture Defenders of the Flag, a Civil War monument made in 1908 by the American sculptor Sally James Farnham. In 2018, it was listed on the National Register of Historic Places. So where you see people filling the bus here is Highland Park in 1888. Nurserymen George Elmwanger and Patrick Berry endowed the Rochester community with 20 acres of land, which became Highland Park, one of the nation's first municipal arboretums. Highland Park is one of many parks designed by Frederick Law Olmsted and was designed with the purpose of retaining a natural appearance. Horticulturist John Dunbar, later known in the local circles as Johnny Lilac Seed, started the park's famous lilac collection in 1892. Some of the 20 varieties he installed were descendants of native Balkan mountain flowers brought to North America by early colonists. <laughs> Oh, 
So at some point they bring you to a big auditorium and have everyone from the group, uh, the entire group, sit down. Now keep in mind, uh, there's no one presenting or anything. Everyone has headphones on. Everyone um, doesn't know what the other person is listening to. So after a bit, a whole group of people stand up and leave. And then the other people are kind of wondering, you know, you're looking around. You know it's part of the experience, right? Because uh, it's, it's being told to them to get up. Um, so it's kind of a surprise. So half the group uh, leaves this building, this auditorium. I believe it was a church, if, uh, and it might even be in this video. And then you continue your tour, and um, then you see arbitrary things that are happening, people dancing and doing, doing other types of things like that, because um, it's being told to them, right? In in the headphones and as you are continue your tour with your group you're going to uh, come in contact with the other group and you're not exactly gonna know what the other groups being told to do and everything so um, you're gonna see a lot of that uh, in this video Something from nothing 
Life lessons come one in a dozen The other eleven get something from nothing Life lessons come one in a dozen The other eleven get something from nothing Life lessons come one in a dozen The other eleven get something from nothing both groups um, coming, forming back together at the top of it. And I don't remember what building we were. Obvi it was, obviously, it was a tall building, and um, the point of it was everyone can look over the city that they just um, walked through. So it was uh, very point, poignant. Poignant is that the is that the word poignant? Point, poignant. I'm not really sure what the word is to tell you the truth. And when you're looking at right now. Um, is uh, craft company number six. Uh, we just happened to be an offshoot of what was done, uh, what we did that day. And when I say we, my ex-wife who was in this um, film with me, um, we went to this place. According to their website, it's a destination for your unique handcrafted American Canadian artisan jewelry, gifts, decorative accessories. Many of our pieces are one of a kind with select items available online visit our store in person to see our full collection so that's from their website now they're still open um this the film was seven years ago but um, they're still open so i will put that link down in the description as well and i will just leave you with the rest of the video and i will see you next time gals and guys i appreciate you as always if you enjoyed this please um, subscribe and you can uh, like it if you enjoyed it if you didn't enjoy it like it anyways what the hell uh share it with uh friends maybe you want to go do some this type of tour someplace in in some state or, or city or town or wherever the hell you are and um hit the bell for updates and that is it gals and guys i will catch you later bye